Hey guys, really quickly today I thought I'd show you playing around with some Peltier junctions. These ones are rated 12 volt 6 amp 90 watt. These are pretty standard in most um, coolers, 12 volt coolers, etc. Pretty cheap to buy on eBay. I got a couple of them. I've played with these before, so I'm going to cut right to the chase. What I did is I took one of these and set it between some e-waste uh, CPU cooler uh, and graphics card cooler heat sinks and a simple little fan. And what I've got it running on right now is a USB. The USB is just from an old mouse. This is an old wheel mouse, optical mouse that was junk in the bin. And I've just hooked it up running it off a of 5 volt so we're severely under driving the fan and the Peltier. The results are pretty impressive for just on 5 volts. Let's have a look. This is going to be just a little bit difficult to get on camera, videoing a camera with a camera, but uh, basically you can see the hot side is we're pushing eh, 29 degrees, and that should be pretty accurate because we do have a matte finish. The emissivity of the metal isn't a problem. But down on the bottom side, we're down around the 20 degree range. That's pretty impressive considering there's no barrier between these two right now. The, the heat can soak back between them. There's no insulation like we would have in a cooler. So that's pretty good results off of just 5 volts. From here, let's go ahead and hook this up to the benchtop power supply and see what we're drawing because I can't monitor it with this. So running at 5 volts, we're pulling about 3 quarters of an amp. Pretty impressive. That's not too bad. That's well within any USB charger capable. So I think we can work with this. If you're interested, let's go ahead and see what it draws at 12 volts. At around 12.2 volts, we're pulling 2.7-ish eh, amps, 2.65. So significantly more current there. That, that's a heck of a lot. But if we can get away with it at less, I think we've got something possible here. We're going to use these in the off-grid cooler, uh, our vaccine cooler. Uh, I mentioned it on the forums before, Glitch did a, a full Coolatron build. I'm attempting to miniaturize this. I, I had a proto of this before and it worked really well. So we're going to build a new one in an upcoming vid. Guys, stay tuned for more uh, Peltier work. Good luck in all your electronics ventures. If this helped you, please consider a thumbs up down below. It really helps the channel, guys. Good luck in all your ventures.